In the following video, you will learn how to configure your DSQ key to your mal user account and learn how to sync patient files to the DSQ. To start, double click on the Mile HTML5 shortcut on your desktop. The name might differ depending on the clinic and may be titled Mile MSA or Mile DSQ. If it is the first time Mile is launched using the shortcut, a pop up window will ask for the clinic's domain address. Enter it here, right before .medfarsolutions.com. Then select OK. If you don't know the domain address, ask the clinic's admin. You are redirected on the My Login page. You will see in the URL section of your browser an MSA ID. This ID is a key giving Mile access to the DSQ and is activated when opening Mile from the shortcut on your desktop. Log into Mile with your username and password and click Login. If it's not done yet, connect your DSQ key to your computer's USB port. To configure your DSQ key for the first time, select the Configuration tab. At the bottom of the page, in the DSQ Thumbprint Certificate section, click this button. Select your name from the list. If you own an administrative DSQ key, the configuration ends here. If you have a clinical DSQ key, click here to finalize the synchronization. A new window asking for your information will pop up. Confirm your gender. Enter your first and last name as registered with your professional order. Select the professional order you're part of from the drop-down list. Add your practice number here. For specialized nurse practitioners, make sure you enter your OIIQ practice number and not your RAMQ number. Once you have confirmed all the information, click Synchronize. In the new pop-up window, enter your DSQ NIP and click here. Your DSQ key is now synced to your Mile account. From now on, launch Mile using the shortcut on your desktop and plug your DSQ key to be automatically synchronized. Note that even if your DSQ key is connected, every first attempt to access the DSQ from Mile on a new session, a pop-up window will ask for your DSQ NIP as a security measure. Before you can access patient's lab results, imaging, and pharmacological profile from the DSQ, you must first sync their file. To do so, click here to access the search option or select the calendar tab to choose patients from upcoming appointments. Go to the patient's file and click the DSQ icon. A red X precedes it if the file is not yet synchronized. In the pop-up window, wait for the information to sync. Confirm that the information on the right corresponds to the information on the left. Then click Accept Sync. The patient files that have already been synced have a green check mark next to the DSQ icon. Close the patient file and repeat the previous steps for every other patient. This action has to be done only once for each patient per clinic.